Yo, welcome back to another video, guys. We have a Taco Bell food review, okay? So they got some new stuff on their menu that we haven't tried yet. As a matter of fact, we haven't even been to Taco Bell in years. You wanna go first or should I go first? You should go first. Okay, but what I really wanna try is this nacho crunch. It has like a nacho, what is this? Like a cheese it mm -hmm. at the bottom, and then it has like the meat, lettuce. I'm, I'm kind of drooling a little bit. I'm so sorry. Uh, the tracking, there's not tracking. There you go. It has the cheese it at the bottom for the crunch, and then it has cheese, it has sour cream, meat, tomatoes, lettuce. It's a tostada. It's like a cheese it tostada. Mm -hmm. Here, let me, let me, oh, oh snap, yeah. my bad, my bad. Let me pull this out so you guys need a better look. I mean, it looks all right, it smells good. Let me see. Bro, that's nasty. Brother, <laughs> That is nasty. Describe the texture. Um, first off, the cheese it isn't even crunchy. It just that does not taste good at <laughs> all. Yo, <laughs> yo, ugh, that doesn't even taste like cheese. Whatever this thing is, you gotta try it. Okay, let's see what Avery's talking about. Yeah, cause the presentation. <laughs> oh, the presentation Lord. first off was off. It's yeah. off. Let's just see how, but sometimes. But it's about the taste. The of taste, the food. yeah. Let's, Don't let's judge a book by yeah, its cover. Can't judge a book by its cover exactly. Okay, I'm gonna put this on top. Brother, ugh. it's like a a Ritz cracker. I'm eating Ritz cracker. Yeah, but it, yeah, it's exactly. Dry. It's dry. It does have a little bit of flavor, but whatever that flavor is, it's not a good one. Ugh. Personally, yeah, it does not taste good. <laughs> At least this time, guys, it's not just me. Yeah, that's no. off. No, so this one, eh, eh, trash. Mm -hmm. We got the big cheese it crunch wrap. Yo, what's up, guys? I just wanted to pause the video really quickly to let you guys know the big crunch wrap supreme is what we're eating in this video, and it turns out that this thing is not good for your health. So here it says. Warning, indicates that the sodium salt content of this item is higher than the total daily recommended um, daily recommended limit, 2,300 milligrams. High sodium intake can increase blood pressure and increase risk of heart disease and stroke. Guys, be aware of what you are eating. Uh, you never know what you're eating. Make sure you check the labels, the website. Naturally, the common healthy person isn't going to worry about this, or many people aren't gonna worry about this, but at the same time, just be aware of what you're eating. That's enough yapping. We're gonna get back to the video. I just wanted to show you guys that there is a warning against this in case you guys wanted to try it. See you guys in the video, peace. Here you go, guys. This one's for you guys. Okay. This is not too bad. It's not too bad? No. It's way better than the the other one. Okay. What well, needs a little, a little sauce here? Oh yeah, we got sauces. So we're we're actually eating out <laughs> of the trunk mm -hmm. <laughs> in this parking lot. So we got the avocado verde salsa. Okay. So I'm gonna try this one. Mmm, this is actually pretty good. Is it spicy at all? Mm -hmm. or? Oh, yeah, it just needs some sauce with it. Mm -hmm. No, I'm sorry. No, this is, this does not taste good at all. Brother, <laughs> First off, what is that that tastes sweet in there? I didn't bite into the part where you put the sauce at. I've been into the corner. First, I mean, it might be the outside. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. But I'm gonna just have one more little bite. Okay. Yeah. That sauce does something. Yeah, it does. That sauce actually gives it a little more flavor. Actually, a lot more flavor. If, if you guys ever had this, let me know if you taste something sweet in yours. So, I don't know, I'm kind of scared because whatever it is, it shouldn't taste sweet at all. First, I'm, I'm gonna try it without the cheese and then I'm gonna dip it in the nacho cheese, okay? Okay, you Hold on. Mmm. These fries are good. Hold on. 
Hold on. I'm gonna go back in for that cheese one more time before I say what I gotta say. Okay, okay, okay. Man, you get out my face, bro. Fight. This cheese is a hit or miss. These fries are good, but this cheese is a hit or miss. Oh. Um, it's all right. I think it's, I mean, the flavor is there. This is very stale and it's cold. <laughs> it just flops. I see where you're like, oh, it tastes good because the flavor is there. I like mine crispy. Yeah, but overall the flavor is there. Mm -hmm. Now try it with the cheese. Oh. I mean, I'd rather have the fries by itself than okay. with the cheese. Okay. The cheese is like adding too much of it because there's already a lot going on with the fries itself. Okay. But with the cheese, it's just another layer of like, it's just going everywhere. Okay. That's where I'm at with this. Anyways, we got a strawberry lemonade freeze. I'm kind of excited to try this. Oh. It's a little fizzy. It's not bad. It's actually pretty good. It's actually not bad. Mm -mm. Um, I, I wouldn't, okay, yeah. to be honest with you, this is like the best thing. That you've had so far. <laughs> yeah. So what we have is a beef five layer burrito. Mmm. Looks like there's cheese, beef, and beans in here. How's it taste? Mushy. Mushy? Yeah, mushy. I'm not a fan of this one. <laughs> I know I'm not gonna be. Ooh, and there's sour cream too. I don't know, I feel like it's doing too much. Maybe some sauce might be good with it. Yeah, try that sauce over there. Yeah. Let's see if it makes a difference yeah. here. And it does. It does? Okay. It does. They overdid it with so much of the flour tortilla. There's not enough meat or any like filling on the inside. It's just a bunch of flour tortilla. And then I feel like the meat and the beans are, it's more like a spread than a filling. You know what I mean? Let me try it with the sauce. There's no meat in here at all. Oh, that's just beans. No, there's meat in there. Where? I don't think they mixed it in pretty well. It's straight beans. I don't know if they can see this. Try, try to go in there. Just straight up beans. Hold on, you can- you, yeah, yeah, it's sour cream, I see it. Yeah. Yeah, because what I had was like everything. Yeah. Uh-uh. Now, we have a nacho cheese Dorito Loco Taco. Again, everything just breaks apart, bro. Like, there's no structure to their food <laughs> at all. But again, it's not about, I guess, about the way it looks, it's about how it tastes. So let's go in. Take another bite. They redeem they so. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that one was good. That, that taco was pretty good. Taco Bell needs to stick to tacos. When it comes to this taco, it is the best thing, the best food that we have in this bag or in this trunk right now. It was very well seasoned, first off. Um, I know it's falling apart a little bit, but I mean, you know, I'm not, I'm not gonna do too much on that. Um. Mm, the flavor on the outside, it's just how I remember. Yeah, I'm gonna have another bite. So we're in the greens. This is the best one that yeah. we've had. Yes, sir. Okay guys, lastly we have the Cinnabon Delight. I want to take out one so you guys can see it. I'm not gonna lie, these actually feel good. They feel soft, they feel firm, enough sugar, enough cinnamon. So it actually feels like it's about to taste good, whatever that means. Okay, so I'm about to go in for a bite. Let's see how this tastes.
Yeah, that's the one. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, these are good. You are gonna enjoy these. I'm imagining these with like a scoop of vanilla ice cream. A scoop of vanilla ice cream with these, with, with, with this cinnamon bun. Oh my goodness. Yo. Mm. I told you. Look at this. It's like a little, it's like something soft on the inside. Yeah, it's like it it's like some jello like not or not jello. jello. It's like um like, like cream. Like creamy like substance on the inside. But Sorry, I didn't even I didn't point that out, but yeah, go ahead. Yeah, it's like it's not overpowering too, because sometimes like creams on the inside, like a donut, it's like you get too much of it. But this one's a very nice balance with everything that comes in place. It's buzzing, buzzing, ain't it? Mm-hmm. And you're right. Getting some ice cream, some vanilla, some vanilla ice, cream ice cream with, with this Ooh. is warm. Ooh. Heat it up. Eat some vanilla ice cream, and you got yourself a dessert there. Ooh. Wow, this is amazing. Yo, thank you guys for watching another food review, Taco Bell food review. This one was, what do you think? It was all right. Overall, probably we'll give this out of five stars, we'll probably give this a two out of five. Um, the dessert saved it, number one, and that taco saved it. Mm -hmm. But all of the crunch wrap, Supremes, burritos, and different things like that, um, we just didn't have a good experience with it. Pretty sure it's not all across the board where every Taco, place, taco Bell place makes their food the same and so who knows maybe one day we'll try a different Taco Bell location or we'll try the same Taco Bell location on a different day because mm -hmm. we understand some businesses and food places can have bad days mm -hmm. just like anybody any other food business or anybody individually so um, yeah we just want to make that clear that just overall our experience with this Taco Bell that we've had today two out of five thank you guys for watching again see you in the next video peace, peace out